In this tutorial, I'd like to show you Mosaic from Yanobox. Mosaic is a very powerful stylization plugin that allows you to create adaptive tiling, pixel texturing, and ASCII effects. I'm in Final Cut Pro 10, but Mosaic also works in Motion, Premiere Pro, and After Effects as well. You can find it in the Effects Browser under Yanobox Mosaic. In addition to a default template, there are a number of built-in presets you can use as starting points. Let's take a look at a few. Mosaic splits your footage into a set of tiles. Each tile is then mapped with an image fragment extracted from a motif called Texture Atlas. The result is a mosaic imitating the color, contrast, details, and distribution of the original image assembled from a custom pattern. I have a clip on my timeline. I'll drag the default mosaic effect to it. In the parameters, I'll go to the Material group. This determines the texture building blocks to mosaic. I'll set this to Technical Elements. This fills the cells with an assembly of graphic elements, numbers, text, and symbols. In the wireframe group, you can add lines to the cells or render the mosaic as pure wireframe using the solo option. I'll twirl down the color controls and move the opacity down a bit. Next, I'll go down to the mapping group and adjust the balance parameter. This changes the distribution of the motif in the darker and lighter pixels. It allows you to add or remove details in the mosaic to better match the original footage. We can animate the position and rotation in the transform group. Now that we've added some movement, I'll go to the rendering group and turn on anti-aliasing so we don't get any artifacts on the lines as they move. Let's add some animated cells onto the eyelid before the eyelid opens at the start of the footage. In the mapping group, I'll check the Add Noise checkbox. I'll keyframe the noise amount and raise the noise frequency considerably. Next, I'll keyframe the noise evolution and noise amount parameters. In the Mosaic Extraction group, I'll set the Composite On menu to Transparent and then animate the Threshold parameter. Next, let's set up a second layer with Wireframe. I'll duplicate my clip above and rename my bottom clip to Wireframe. I'll reset the Threshold parameter. Next, I'll go to the Wireframe group, set the Wireframe to White, and adjust the Opacity slightly. Next, I'll animate the wireframe's threshold parameter. Like the other products from Yanobox, Mosaic is an incredibly powerful stylization tool that will kick your projects up to the next level. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects. And if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com.